All I'm saying is that we'll all be judged in the end. All of your brothers. And you, Patrick. And you, Kate. Who's gonna judge Kate? What would she win if they did, Virgin of the Year? No. I'm thinking maybe you can catch VD for both Fuck of us, you, Patrick. Fuck you, Katie. Language. Sorry, Ma. Ho ho, there he is, Mr. Fucking Crazy Man. You want a beer? No. Good, because I ain't fucking got none. Very funny. Maybe if being a drunkard doesn't work out, you can be a comedian. Fuck off. <laughs> and you, Kate, fuck off out of here. But aren't you going to introduce us? Sure. This is Nico, some drug dealing to fucking generate from some armpit in Eastern Europe. That's my ma. Nice to meet you. Hi. And this is my sister. Lovely lass, scared to bits of life. And fucking off out of here right now before I throw a fucking bottle at her. Patrick. Nice to meet you. Likewise. See you around. Bye. What a girl. I think she likes you. Word to the wise, though. She don't put out, which is convenient, because if she did, I'd have to kill you. Understood. Good lad. You got any drugs on you, boy? No. Nope. Shit. Well, probably a good thing. We got some business to take care of. Come on. We've got business out at the docks in Algonquin. Where's your car, man? We need a car. Jesus Christ! Your brother Jerry's had word from Ray Bacino, his Italian contact, about a big shipment coming in near the fish market. The triads are expecting something and it smells fishy. The fish market smells fishy? Shit, man! I keep forgetting you're not from here. Something smelling fishy means that it ain't quite right. So, this shipment smelling fishy means that it ain't gonna be what they say it is. But if it's going to the fish market, they must be saying that it's fish. So? So if this shipment is what they say it is, then it's going to smell fishy anyway. Shut the fuck up. You think you're a right fucking comedian, don't you? Learn the damn language. Anyways, I was in Algonquin last night partying with some sweet college chicks. Yes? You should come along next time. Really? Sure, sure. Guy like you, you'd have a good time. Unless you're hoping to see me sis again. If that's what's going through your brain, then we got ourselves a problem. Oh, yeah? The problem's that you'll be letting yourself in for a lifetime without getting action. And I know what happens to a man when he ain't getting any. It ain't pretty. So you got yourself a girlfriend back? I do and I don't, if you know what I mean. It usually means you don't, right? Uh, you're a perceptive guy. I got the lowdown on you from Elizabeth. Some guys I know have checked you out as well. I think me and you could get along. I need a guy like you on our team. Don't you got other guys to help you out? You're from here. You should know everyone. Well, that's the fucking problem. Everyone in the neighborhood hell, in the whole fucking city knows us. You can't trust people. I only trust my family, some of them at least, and people I don't know. That's why you're on this job with me. Because you don't know me. That and you saved my life. Saving someone's life has got to count for something in this fucked up age we live in. It depends on the life, I guess. Tell you what, I'll snort a load of rails, Fuck a lot of drunk girls, get into fights on a nightly basis, and die young leaving a scarred, bloated corpse. That sound like the sort of life worth saving? Most definitely. Help! All right, here we are. What's the plan? We get up on the roof of that warehouse. There should be a good view of the dock so we can scope that shit out. Follow me, Nico. Don't they make these places easier to break into?
This is where the deal's meant to be going down. And here's the boat, right on time. See those boxes on the back of the boat? They must be bringing clone meds. Meds? Yeah, stuff that'll stop housewives cutting their wrists and make their husbands get wood. Meds. Molly, sedatives, antidepressants, meds. Okay, how do we do it? We'll wait until the truck is loaded, then we'll take it. Simple as that. I'll cover you from up here while you're down on the ground cleaning up. These better be some good fucking pills. The housewives better be grateful. Nico, you drive. I'll take out anyone who tries to follow us. We're going up to Ray's Lockup in Westminster off of Union Drive West. Driving in Liberty fucking city, eh? Fucking match for me! Shit, Nico, these cocksuckers are all over us! I thought you meant the love of the Irish! I fucking do! It's just that we've got your fucking Slavic driving skills as well! That's if we're ever gonna get out of this fucking jam! Put your foot down, man! What the hell? Is it trying to you already? There's a bunch of grenades in here! Pass them up, Pecky! I'll, I'll give them a chance to their own fireworks!
The stuff all in there? Sure is. All safe and sound. Whole truckload of it. A lot of wives and mistresses are gonna be happy when their men get a hold of those, huh? Whole city's gonna be hard in a few days' time. Who's this? That's my boy, Nico. He's an absolute savior. Couldn't have done it without him. Nico! Come over here! You work for these mick bastards. Fucking guinea. I work for whoever's paying. I might give you a call sometime. Get in, Packy. Hey, I'll catch you around, man. <laughs>